We kept talking all year about April 1st because yeah. April 1st is typically when you have the deepest snowpack and has everything to do with how uh, Department of Water Resources decides that that water is going to be used later in the spring as well as in the summer and how much is available. Well, we got tons of it, right? So it is possible that parts of that snowpack will still be up there into the beginning of June, possibly the middle of June. And that's exactly what we want, right? We want all that water to slowly melt so we can take advantage of it. Take a look at the wind advice. That's still in effect until 11 o'clock this morning. We got the valley floor, western side of the valley floor. These locations had the best opportunity today to see winds gusting up to around 45 miles per hour. Could see some local power outages. That wind advisory expires at 11 o'clock this morning. Speaking of the winds, they've been all over the place, right? And spring is indicative of wind, right? Take a look at the temperatures. 68 coming in for Thursday, 70 coming in for Friday, 72 for Saturday. We go up. We head right back down as we're watching another low pressure system coming in around Monday that could yield a few mountain showers and maybe in a few showers for the valley floor. Not a heavy hitter, but I can't rule out some type of activity. So what's ahead? Cool and breezy, at least to start the day. Winds diminishing into the afternoon. Warmer conditions coming in for the weekend, and I use that word liberally. And then mountain showers possible as we move into late Monday and Tuesday. Speaking of the mountains, Saturday and Sunday for the Sierra, 56 coming in Saturday, 54 for Sunday. For the foothills, you got 68 degrees on Saturday, 67 coming in for Sunday. And when you take a look at the forecast for the valley, that is nice. 74 for Saturday, uh, 72 coming in for Sunday. And then we get to what could be a few changes in the forecast, and that's going to be the opportunity for, as we move closer to the weekend, the chance for more cooler weather coming into play and also the opportunity for a few showers as well. That is a look at your first alert weather this morning with your seven day forecast.